Welcome to my channel, Playing with Maserati and Scripture Writing by Honey. I am going to be doing what's in my faith tote. So this is what I've been carrying around for a while. And yeah, so let's begin. So welcome to the channel. Please subscribe, hit that post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. Please give this a big thumbs up, leave a comment, and if you could share the video, that'd be greatly appreciated. Okay, so this is the gardening tote at Michael's that I got, I want to say last year. I picked up two of these. I believe they were like $14.99 and then you could use that 50% off coupon and I think I got it like for 7 But this is a wonderful tote. It's really good. So let's start with unloading this thing. So here you have, how many pockets? One, two, three, four pockets on this side. And when you turn it around, it's the exact four pockets. It's got a little piece of, I have no idea, maybe food or something on the bottom. But yeah. So you get four decent sized deep pockets. So there's nothing in these pockets. Again, I just started carrying this. Oh no, I lied. There's a little dusty sticky notes that says, Be Yourself. I believe these were Dollar Tree. And I just, again, just, you just stick it in there. They're so deep, they're not really going to come out. Okay, so let me see how I can do this. I'm going to try to lift it a little bit like that. I think it's good. As you can see, there's a top in here as well, and I'll show you that. On the front side, or what well, doesn't even really matter what is the front side. Let me move this stuff out the way. That way you can get it a little bit more better view. I'm sorry if I'm moving you a little too much. Okay, so either way is front or back. So we'll start with this side where I have my little books from Dollar Tree. So I have the NLT Bible Promise Book for Men. And that is the UPC. So in here, it even has like a note section. It's just anything about, like, your needs, justice, Jesus Christ. And it gives you little verses, you know, when you need help living a godly life. And then it gives you, you know, some information. So this is really good. This is a really good book. In the beginning, you have your contents, and it's in alphabetical order, like your abilities, your absence, accountability, anger, empathy, attitude, backsliding, so things like that, and then it'll give you verses for it. So this is a really good book from Dollar Tree, one dollar. And it says, apply God's word for the, f apply God's word to your life today, NLT. The next one I have, again, from, Do I think this is from Dollar, yeah, no, Our Daily Bread. It says, God is with us, Christmas Reflections from Our Daily Bread. That is the back. So our daily get bread gives you a lot of stuff. So you like here you have day one, today's Bible reading. So I will be focusing on this with in Chris you know, in Christmas, during Christmas. But I just leave it in here. Just as, you know, storing all my Bible stuff in here. So the next pocket, and again, these are very deep pockets. This pocket I have my little no problem. No problema. Your llama fun. And then this just holds, let me take them out, different color pens. I think there's a pencil. Um, obviously, the cap came off. So it's just purple on the inside, decent size. I just throw it in here so I carry a tweezers for like when you want to do it with stickers. Pick up your stickers, really good. Pencil lead, paper mate. Um, a pigmographic archival ink. It's number one in black. Oh no, I'm sorry, number seven in black. There you go. Um, this is like this uh, Stedler or whatever, but it's the generic version in pink. So on one side you have the fine line, very pretty color. And on the other side is a bold. So I love this one. 
And I'll just stick these back in here while I'm doing it. Pencil with different leads in there. You can't have one, you need at least two. You just pop these up, see? And you can just stick them on the bottom. And then the next one comes up. Has a little racer on top. I find the caps don't fit. This one here is an Energel liquid gel ink in 0.7 metal tip. Very nice pen. Writes very nicely. And again, I have more of those Stedler, whatever you want to call them, pens. So I have a black. Is that black or forest green? Might be forest green. Orange, a green, like an olive green, like a cranberry color, and a very pretty blue. So I just stick them in here, and I just, so this doesn't show like the llama drama. I just stick it like that. So there you have that. And there's nothing inside here. So I'm going to show you the inside of here. The handles are very great. They're very usable. I mean, you could just put them on your your shoulder. Not your shoulder, like your um, elbow. And then you could just carry it. But this is very super heavy. So I don't recommend, you know, carrying it everywhere with you because you will have a bad elbow. An elbow that is bad. <laughs> As you can see, I have a lot of stuff in here. So what I'm going to do is just move it to the side and grab stuff out. You'll still kind of see me doing it, though. So the next one I have is the chicken soup for the soul. Have a little faith. Got this from Dollar Tree. It's Amy Newark. And then she has another one that says Count Your Blessings. I'm sure she has plenty more. And again, this is just different little things. Election Day Setback, Unexpected Blessings, God's Faithfulness. So whenever you just want a quick read, this is great to grab. And it says, have a little faith. Um, the next thing I have in here, and I'm just randomly going back, front and back. I have my Traveler's Notebook I'm thinking of using for faith only. And in here, this is from Agenda 52, I want to say. Very pretty girl. Uh, let's see. It says, let's make everything beautiful. And then I haven't even set it up. I have praises. So when I want to do something with that. Because I have so many books that I want to start doing stuff with. This one here is a calendar. And I started this in September 2018, it looks like. And I was going to do, like, writing your handwriting in practice. But I think I'm going to change it for the next month and do something with this, with scripture. Uh, let me put this a little down. Okay, there you go. So a little scripture, so you have your monthly calendar. And then after the calendar, you just have paper. So you have line paper, grid paper. I think that's it. I don't think there's any... Oh, and dot paper. It has a little heart on the bottom. So that is that one. I haven't even put it on the elastics yet. And then this one here, and this is by the American Crafts. You have grid, line, and a calendar. And a plain paper. So there's another one. I don't know what I'll do with it yet. Just a little acetate. And then this one's on here. And this is just blank cream color paper. But I think that one came with this, if I'm not mistaken. So I just have that in there, which is a traveler's notebook. Um, next, I have a orange book. I think this was from Michael's. I've had it for so long. I was going to put something here. I don't know what yet, but it is. Oh, and I have like one of those... Dollar Tree cutting mats that I use just like if I want to use it, I don't know, for whatever. This is old. I cut pages out of here. This is lined paper. Do I have another one? Yes, I do. Actually, I have a couple of things in here I'll show you in a second. That's falling out. So the back don't have a pocket. And all it is is lined paper. 
So you can journal in here or do anything like scripture writing or whatever. So that's what I'm going to be using soon. Some sticky notes that I made on a card. What is that? I have no idea. And then just something I made. And then again, acetates. So that is that. And I just stick that in here. Next one, I have Faith That Overcomes by Joyce Myers. I got this for a dollar. And then it's like chapters and scriptures. I think it has questions as well. I haven't focused on this one yet, but I will be soon. I love the fact it has gold foiling on the edges. It has no uh, paper in the back, not notebook, but paper in the back. Salvation starts here. And then just a lot of conclusions and then chapters. So these are really good books. I got that for a dollar. Next one, you wouldn't believe what, what fits in this bag. The next one is the American Crafts sticker book for $19.99, American Crafts. For the Faith, I haven't used it yet, but I will be soon. Okay, so now, there's no pocket in here, it's just wide open. So that's why you're able to fit a lot of stuff. So I'm going to go towards this side where you see my hand. Because I have it where, like, some stuff's on the side and then everything else is lined up. Okay, so on this side, what I'm grabbing is the Faith Warrior sticker book and you've seen these many times that was a good book and I need to pick up another one the next one is my mini binder my war binder I've showed this one in videos a couple times and as you can see I added stickers I added the Martha Stewart pockets there's sticky notes and what's inside here Oh, that's sticky notes, I'm sorry. Um, snap tabs, I got two of those. Sticky tabs and stickers for Jesus. And then I just stick them all in here and it just sits nicely. See, it's perfectly. This came with the binder as well as this. Some sticky notes. Oh, almost messed that up. And then here I just put a... Another pocket, but I sliced it so that I'm able to stick the dots on the back. So if I need to make something sticky, I have dots. This is from Chrissy Ann Designs. I kept thinking this was with this binder, but it's not. It's Chrissy Ann Designs. Sticky notes. I have my In Touch for June, which I haven't really worked on it yet. With some paper. It should be another one. And then in touch for July. Again, I have not worked on this, which I should have. Um, some sticky sticky notes and you know, like a little sticky, you know, post-it notes. And then this pocket came with this is from the Target Dollar Spot. This pocket came with the binder. I think this is from Target Dollar Spot. And then I have just things I found off Instagram. I mean, not Instagram. Uh, Pinterest. 31 Days of the Bible Reading Plan of Overcoming Fear. If you have fear. And then some extra paper. And then it comes with dividers. 13 Reasons Why Not. Fruits of Your Spirit. Bible verses when you like feel alone, need joy, prayers. Um, I've been working on this one, which is the ABC of God's character. And yeah, I put the stickers. There's more ABC scriptures, and I'm not done with this one. I'm still working on. As you can see, there's the letters. The next divider is books to buy. So so far, I have two. I think that's it on this one. The next one is my Our, Our Daily Bread. And this is for July, August, and September. I'm so behind in July. 
because we're moving, so I will be working on that to catch up so I can do August and September. And that's our daily bread. I cut the book down. Once these are done, I will end up taking this out and putting it into a new binder and then just keep going with it. So that's this whole book, because this is a big book. This goes for three months. And then I have more paper so I can journal about what I'm reading. Then I have this binder belongs to that came with it. The paper came with it. And then in the back, uh, let me move all this here. I found my in touch for April. And then I have another stick, uh, Martha Stewart. And I just added some stickability stickers that are faith related. So that'll sit here. And I sliced it so that these bags can stay in its, the stickers can stay in its own bag. Okay, so that is that one. And this is the after and before. No, Afterthought and Before binder from Office Max or Office Depot. One of the two. This is a long video. Sorry. There's only a few more things. The next one you've seen quite a few times is my war binder. I did go ahead and take the scripture writing out of here. So I left that. Next, I have the scripture writing as you've seen, that we're working on. This is where I keep the scripture writing. Look how many pages. This was not going to fit in here any longer. And here I just have a bunch of stickers. And I've showed you this in the past. The pockets. With more stickers. You know, and then all my scripture writing. Wait. It looks blank, but it's not. And then the last I have are some stickers that you've seen. Uh, on the edge of time, preparing for the crisis ahead. I got this free in the mail by peacefinders.org. If you go on there, you can probably get the same book for free. Um, Dollar Tree. I got all of these books. Nine Fruits of the Spirit, Gentleness. And I still have more I have not put in here. This bag is getting a little heavy. Nine Fruits of the Spirit, Patience, for Joy, and Faithfulness. And in here you just have a lot of stuff. Just answer, you could answer questions. So it's kind of like a devotional, I think, if that's what a devotional is. And then inside is my dusty bag. And it's a very huge bag. This is made for gardening. I'm going to move all this stuff out the way. Well, actually not. But yeah, so this is made for gardening. But I use it for my planners. I have one for like sticky notes and stickers. And then I have this one for my faith. So again, thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Hit the post notification bell so you don't miss out on any new videos. And yeah hit the share button and I will talk to you in the next video. I hope you enjoy this video. This is how I carry my faith. Thank you for watching. Talk to you in the next one. Bye-bye.